today on JTV, we're creating this beautiful special event centerpiece. And you'll be over the moon about these beautiful yellow roses. The new yellow moon from Esmeralda Farms. We have a special treat for you today. The new variety from Esmeralda, yellow moon. Esmeralda Farms were established in 1972. And in 1996, they launched their own breeding and biotech program allowing Esmeralda to create and breed and develop new exciting flower varieties, unique and exclusive to Esmeralda Farms. You're probably familiar with many of the varieties they've already developed. And today, this is one of their newest varieties, Yellow Moon. Esmeralda is a market leader in production of diverse assortments of fresh cut flowers and varieties, and they guarantee the freshness and quality. Esmeralda grows their unique products on their wholly owned farms in Colombia, Peru, Mexico, Ecuador, and Costa Rica. And they embrace product quality at every critical stage, from field to wholesale distributor through their state-of-the-art cold chain management system. And we always talk about our JTV Green Alert. They're one of the few growers and importers to be certified by three green labels. Esmeralda Breeding and Biotech today gives us another exclusive Esmeralda variety, Yellow Moon. This radiant yellow rose has exceptional vase quality. Deep green foliage, and no harsh chemicals are ever used at Esmeralda, so we continue to have beautiful foliage. It's a gorgeous opener. And Esmeralda believes that roses are about performance. And when these are fully open, they're absolutely incredible. They maintain their vibrant color throughout their entire lifespan. Today, we're going to be pairing Yellow Moon with two outstanding Esmeralda varieties. Their Jade. This electric green trachylium has been a hit throughout our entire industry. That beautiful color is so amazing. And we're adding to that their new improved Esmeralda Solidago. It's a Mardi Gras variety, so we have quality and quantity inside the package. Notice that the flowers are larger and firmer. It's giving us a fuller impact. These selections mean better quality and value for you as the designer. It's only fitting with a beautiful rose like Yellow Moon that we create something that will light up the night the same way that Yellow Moon lights up our JTV stage today. So we'll be creating a special event centerpiece. Be using this tray on top of here, and let's fill this up with something interesting to start with. We've got some extra large deco beads. We'll start with a balance of them there. Then we'll add the new Sub 3 Acolytes. These have a switch that allow you to turn them on, to have them be a flicker, or have them be a flash. For today's project, we're going to use the flicker. The fact that we can make these flicker gives great activity to our arrangement. The switch is convenient, so it allows us to change those speeds.
That's a great way for us to dress up the container and then our arrangement will sit on top. Our next step is to add some curly willow. I've taken these curly willow pieces and attached acolytes directly to them. Put them on a wire and these turn on with just the little pull switch. That's great. Those look like fireflies then. And down below, we've got that great reflective quality. Perfect for yellow moon. I love their solidago. And the Mardi Gras new solidago is incredible. Look at this one stem. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14 usable, beautiful pieces of solidago. Now that's value. This might even represent a bunch of regular solidago you might get from someone else. This itself was one stem, part of my entire bunch of beautiful Esmeralda Mardi Gras solidago. I love how the pieces themselves, too, have such strong apical dominance, and they're so full and voluptuous. We're going to add these in groupings through our arrangement. I felt that it was important today to add these pieces, the three unique colors that we have, in a wonderful analogous color scheme in groupings so that it's not completely polka dotted throughout we're making strong impact with each one of the varieties we're going to use in today's arrangement. So I've got a great cluster like that. I'll do that in a couple other spots. We've got over 45 different lateral usable pieces from one bunch of the Mardi Gras Solidago from Esmeralda. And this is one bunch only used in this arrangement. It's a perfect opportunity for you to take the value of this product and extend that throughout your special events and weddings. So now, we'll add the green trachylium. The green and yellow color combination is such an important analogous color scheme. We're seeing that used so frequently now. With yellow being the number one color of the year in 2009, it slowly migrated its way into wedding and special event. So we're seeing more yellow dresses, we're seeing more beautiful yellow flowers like Yellow Moon, and we're seeing it paired with this wonderful electric fresh green. Those two colors are next to one another on the color wheel and it gives us a great, friendly connection that's impactful at the same time. I always talk about using green colors together. And when you place a green coloration next to another color, it helps that other color bubble up. Jade is an incredible product because what happens with it is not only are we introducing that great green color, we're also introducing an incredible texture. It's so different 
from other types of flowers that we use. And since we've got these next to one another, it creates a great juxtaposition. You'll also notice the amazing laterals on the jade as well. We've got this great central piece right here. We've used that, but then look at how that leaves us with these extra pieces. We could even use this piece, nice and long by itself, branching. It's a great effect. And look at how those pieces become slightly pendulous and dangle out there at the end. How beautiful is that? So in this arrangement, we have two and a half bunches, one bunch of solid agro and one and a half bunches of jade. Great volume and incredible value. So now it's time to add the yellow moon. These beautiful open blossoms hold incredibly well. And the vibrant foliage, I can use that as an accent point inside the arrangement as well. That lush green foliage is a great contrast for us to that jade trichilium as well. We've got two tones of green going together. I'm going to go ahead and fill this in. Like giving these last couple good elevation so that they're sticking up in the center of the arrangement. Doesn't make it look so round and it gives it a little bit more of a serendipity look. Now, I'm going to add a couple more things. Got a big bunch of bear grass here. What I'm going to do is just tighten up the rubber band on this so it's nice and tight. I'm going to move it down to about there and cut off that piece. So I've got a nice little piece like that. Stick two wood picks in it and our rubber band is holding those wood picks in place. We'll tuck that in right in the center so that we get some good activity cascading over from one side. That looks pretty wonderful. And this one I'm going to take in in the back side. I'm going to bring it right across the edge of the container. So we're just laying it inside there. We'll use a couple of the wood picks to go directly through it and into the bouquet. Go in at opposing angles so it holds it nice and tight. We'll conceal that with one more rose. These yellow moon are so big, it's just going to take one to hide our mechanics. We're going to let that flow out onto the table itself. Because it's a great special event centerpiece, I want to bring that yellow content right down here to the table.
we'll use the solid ago to create a collar all the way around this sphere and then fill it in with yellow moon roses. And one more. Perfect. It's a great pull point for us to draw our eye through and drop it down here with the reward being the beautiful impact of those vibrant yellow moon roses. The new flat wire from Oasis has been really popular because it just uses such a great line with that flat wire appearance. So what I want to do is just add that around this and bring it up. and through the arrangement. That allows our eye to travel all the way through. There's all sorts of embellishments we can use, but in this case, it's just a wonderful glittery line that helps reinforce our eye from the focal area of this sphere up into our arrangement. What a fast, easy special event centerpiece thanks to the quality and value that we get with these wonderful Esmeralda products. The fuller new improved Solidago Mardi Gras, the Jade Trichilium vibrant green, and the beautiful radiant yellow moon all brought to you by Esmeralda Farms. Until next week, keep having fun with flowers.